Welcome to iHeart Reviewing Stuff. Uh, so I figured I'll do a chat since there are barbecue reveal Chelsea Series 2 uh, for the lamb, teddy bear, poodle, and lion that these have matching larger dolls. Uh, I would have honestly actually bought one of these over a Barbie since that's what I did for the previous series that had Chelsea ones. But yeah, I'm very disappointed in these. Uh, so we'll get to why. So there are Amazon links on this You Love It website. Uh, it looks like they released today. Um, if you look at like the release date on Amazon, but I think only one and I can't remember which one. Uh, it wasn't this first one. It was like, uh, I feel like the third one down maybe, uh, that I think said it would ship within like one to two months. But I think the other one said unavailable. So yeah, so here they are. And like, I mean, <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes Chelsea's face looks a little creepy to me. These ones are kind of giving me that creepy vibe. Um, I'm not sure why. I'm going to have to like look at the ones from the Jungle series or whatever it was called. Um, the first series of Cutie Reveal Chelsea ones uh, that had like, I only got the toucan, but I liked the elephant was my favorite. Uh, and then what? There was a monkey and a tiger. And I did kind of like the tiger kind of gave me like some Lisa Frank vibes. So I was always kind of tempted uh, to get that one. Uh, but yeah, I wouldn't recommend these um, because they don't have knee or elbow articulation like the other ones do. Um, they are $14.99 instead of $17.49. So I don't know. I'm guessing Mattel, maybe like the sales weren't doing as good. Um, or maybe, I don't know what made them take away the articulation. Because these, I don't know, to me it kind of seemed like a cool idea because I think um at least in my experience with Chelsea like I don't super collect Chelsea uh but I feel like I've paid attention to it since probably like 2016 2017 of like you know what little Chelsea dolls um are and I don't recall ever seeing any have articulation so I thought it was cool I mean it wasn't like the best articulation but I mean it seemed I would say it was like the mini extra dolls because those only have like elbow and knee articulation as well. They don't have any wrist, um, which I know sometimes bothers people. Uh, it's pretty fine with me. Um, I can see where like, you know, it does kind of limit some posability though um, with your dolls to not have wrist. So yeah, I don't know why they took it away, but I mean, they lowered the price. So maybe they thought lowering, being able to lower the price maybe felt more important to them as a company than to give the articulation. But anyway, what I was going to say was that Target right now, today's the last day for the spend $50, get $10 off or spend $100, get, tw get $25 off. Um, toy coupon that released last Sunday uh, that I, and you can use it more than once because I used the spend $100, get $25 off twice. Uh, in my same account, like I didn't switch accounts or anything to use it more than once. Um, sometimes Target, I don't know if it's an error or if they're feeling generous. Because um, I would say, I feel like most of the time the coupon's kind of like a one-time use, but every once in a while it's like multiple. Um, so anyway, uh, so I did use it twice. I didn't use the spend 50, get $10 off ones. Those ones never tempt me as much as the spend 100 get $25 off. Uh, so anyway, but the previous series to these is on sale, 30% off. So 30% off of $17.49. I think made them like $12.59 or something. I know under, they definitely hit under uh, the $15 mark and definitely are cheaper than these newest ones. And at least I would recommend them over this because you get um, the elbow and knee articulation. So these still come with the little pet. Um, looks like she still has these little hoof shoes. She still has a little mascot head. Uh, let's see. And you'll, you'll still get like an actual pair of shoes and a skirt. Uh, I'm trying to figure out. Okay, so the more stock images are probably on Amazon that will show you um, 
because I did click the Amazon links just to go check on there. This one looks a little less creepy to me, <laughs> the lion, um, than who was the first one, the lamb. Uh, there's more photos. So if you click the Amazon link and you want to see what I'm talking about with the articulation, you'll see that these are like the ones that like, aren't they usually, they may have gone up in price, but I feel like they were always kind of like a $6.99 price point. Um, sometimes had painted on uh leggings or body suits and stuff but sometimes i think you could get ones that actually just have like clothes on and then there's always like the dreamtopia like mermaids and fairies and stuff too with the chelsea uh dolls so yeah this is the lion um so yeah these okay this isn't really showing all the stock images that they have these also come wearing um similar to the other ones uh the like sewn on shirt thing that I mean I'm pretty sure it's a sew sewn on shirt to like their bodysuit they're wearing so this just isn't really showing that you can get a little peek of it here I guess so this is the poodle uh, with some blue streaks actually this one doesn't look creepy to me either so I guess the lion and poodle but I think the fourth one did look creepy to me that we're gonna get to um, so yeah I don't think you get any pants to these and I can't actually remember if the jungle series ones uh or series one whatever they call this uh if the first cutie reveal Chelsea's uh had any sort of pants or if they were just wearing some sort of kind of more like pajama looking dress or something because these definitely kind of give some pajama vibes with the shirt being on it I actually can't uh, even remember very well <laughs> what the first ones were like. It's been a while since I unboxed that toucan one. Um, so yeah, and then here's this one. I don't know, the eyes were creeping me out with this one earlier. Um, they still kind of do. I don't know what it is. Because uh, yeah, she just looks like, I will eat your soul. Ha ha ha. <laughs> like, I don't know, she kind of creeps me out. Um, I mean, I like a little bit of pink in the hair, but I don't know. The eyes on this one are tripping me out. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I guess the good news is with these that they're a little cheaper. So if you like a $14.99 price point, better than $17.49. Of course, always keep in mind that, you know, like recently Target put them 30% off. So then that makes them actually cheaper than these new ones. Um, but I could see people liking the Barbie ones of these uh, because I think there is like a lot of pastel vibes and definitely there's Barbie collectors who like when Barbie goes like pastel. Um, I I'm not super uh, in love with pastels, uh, but I thought these were cute. I'm just so bummed because I really would have bought one if they had knee and elbow articulation. And really would have loved if, like, I don't know, this whole t-shirt thing wasn't sewn on to, like, the fuzzy outfit part of the bear. Um, or lion or poodle or... Ugh, what's the other one? Lion, poodle, lamb. <laughs> I just look at that lamb again. Um, but yeah, Chelsea, I don't know. They kind of change the screening sometimes, I feel like. Because this is not my favorite mouth or eyes for Chelsea I feel like there's been some other ones or I, I don't know what it is something or the head shape is tripping me out um I think I noticed it with the color reveal Chelsea mermaids I feel like there was two series of those and I think I liked the first one more than the second one I feel like the second one was giving these kind of vibes that this one has um I'll have to go back and look at them again but I feel like unless I'm tripping but I think I don't know it feels like the eyes look kind of big and even the mouth looks kind of big for such a tiny doll and like head but it could be the head shape is also tripping me out I don't know something about it I'm just not super liking but again for all I know it isn't like a difference at all so I could be totally wrong I can't really tell. It looks like she's going to have, like, hoof things on her arms as well. 
I would assume maybe this is removable, so maybe it's just like a glove piece or something <laughs> on there. Because uh, I'm pretty sure the t-shirt dress thing, um, which is interesting. Yeah, I'm going to have to look at the toucan again to see, like, did they not get pants with those ones? Uh, but yeah, there's more stock images on Amazon. Because, yeah, we can see, like, you know... You, they say six surprises, but they're probably counting this color reveal thing. You know, you wake up your pet. Um, I don't think anything for Chelsea's face on these, I don't think. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was a real shame that these went in the color reveal and I guess just kind of even like non-mystery. Even though these, you know, you know which one you're going to get. You just don't see it until you like take it out and take that mascot head off. Um, but yeah, I was just bummed that they took away the articulation, but I understand, like, maybe they thought it was better to lower the price, um, on them. Like, I'm sure somebody, like, probably analyzed their sales, because I would imagine these probably don't do as well as the Barbie ones. Um, I'm honestly not really sure how well the Barbie ones do, like, in my area. Because I feel like I always see some at Walmart or Target, like, on the shelf. Um, but not, like, a large, large quantity. And the color reveal has died down. Like, sometimes there used to be just so, so much. Um, oh, I remember now. One Walmart, though, in my area had a ton of when the sloth, unicorn, there was a bear, and one other. Um, oh, the llama. Uh once which what was that was that the second i think that was the second wave of cutie reveal barbie um that i think there was a walmart that had like a huge end cap of them and i kick myself now because you can't really find the sloth anymore and that was my favorite one of the four of those uh i didn't really like the llama i think my daughter liked the unicorn and i wasn't really feeling the purple bear uh in that series they do a bear almost in like every wave it seems like so i don't know what that's about um but anyway yeah this one i would say i f like the poodle and the lion are the cutest but yeah i don't know these feel like a pass for me just because I saw this pop up on You Love It and I was like, oh, yay, like, this is cool. Like, there are going to be Chelsea ones because I wasn't sure if there was or not. But then I was just so bummed, like, as soon as I went to the Amazon link and saw, like, the stock images, I was like, oh, but you, they don't have the elbow and knee articulation. And I noticed the price was, like, cheaper. So anyway, thanks for listening. Uh, bye.